So the question is, we often get from practitioners is, is tobacco addiction over in Canada? And my response to them is no. We almost have five million smokers still, and that's uh, essentially one in four to one in five Canadians who still smoke. So we have to figure out a way to help them uh, break their addiction because many try every year and uh, almost as many fail. So we've got to figure out a way to help them get access to evidence-based treatments to help them stop. The CanAdapt project and the guidelines are Canadian adaptation of guidelines to be applied by healthcare professionals in their daily practice. And uh, healthcare professionals can be assured that that has gone through and vetted through the eyes of experts as well as through the eyes of practitioners and is based on the existing evidence that has been collected internationally about what works in smoking cessation. And so if we do want to have uh, better health in Canada, especially uh, for those who smoke, we have to figure out how we help them uh, quit. And Canada guidelines, if applied across different disciplines and different settings, can certainly help uh, do that. So my advice to people is to get involved uh, join the network, look at canadapt.net, uh, Google it, and uh, and join it as soon as you see it, and, and contribute. Contribute your stories, contribute what you've learned, and take something from it, and look at what the guidelines have to say.